Well, chat, welcome to this segment. Definitely not something I said before just a minute ago. It's VRML Worlds. And uh, no, this is this is something that you may be familiar with. You may not, but I'll explain it here. Just read all this. So it's basically um, it's a 3D environments all over the net. When you access a URL, um, it contains a VR ML world. The files downloaded into your web browser and um, you can see 3D things. So a lot of this stuff is from the 90s. Here, here's a better description here. Look, look, it says here it's pronounced Vermel and it's not just another plugin. To a growing community, Vermel represents the seeds of new web, a web more like the real world, experiential, interactive, continuous, and of course, three dimensional. So, yeah, there's a lot to read here if you want to pause that, but I'll show you some stuff. Jack will put this packle together and I think. I checked out a little bit of it earlier, and it's it's definitely weird, and I think um, some of it will be interesting. However, I have to use Internet Explorer. So, alright. I'm gonna go to Interactable, and uh, let me give you an example of what this stuff even is. So here it is using something called Cortona 3D, not Cortana. And by the way, a lot of this stuff, yes, you could access this from the comfort of your web browser in the year 1990 something. And here's what you would do with it. Wow. quite revolutionary. Let's see what happens. Whoa! Unfortunately, I haven't found a way to turn off the uh, pop-up there. So, we'll just check these out. A lot of this is just like little things, just little animations and, and interactable things. I don't know. But this is the type of stuff that would keep you entertained for hours in the 90s. <laughs> you just click on the little fellas and they do something funny. And then you move on to the next little fellas. Chat, hang on a second. Just a second here. I want to see if I can... Uh... No, no, hang on. I think I got this. It's him. I think I just need to make the hat. Well, actually, what can I do here with the... What does that do? Oops. Eh. We'll leave it. But yeah, this is the original me creator chat. There he is. Same thing, basically the same thing.
biblically accurate <laughs> social media influencer. <laughs> You grow an extra eye. All right. Let's see. Drive in. So there's two players for this and one this stuff opens up. These are dot WRLs, right? And they open up in Internet Explorer in Cortona 3D. Um, then I also have Flux Player, which we'll check out later. I don't really know what the point of that is. Well, I know what the point of it is. It's a drive-in movie. This one's called Detail G. What the fuck? Oh, there's a headlight button, too. Whoa, 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 thing exploded! Weird. I don't know why, but this one's called Elmo.WRL. This man just bought more land in the metaverse, or, or he saw some, some Bertsons. I'm trying to figure out what this is. So it's, it's interactable, but it doesn't seem like there's a whole lot to do here. Oh, wait, 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 something's going on. Just people racing. That's pretty much it. You can turn the headlights off and it gets darker. Okay. Click the box. Then click the horse. Nice Comic Sans, by the way. Pumpkin House. 10,000 hits. Congratulations. Vinny, why are you playing Facebook's Metaverse? <laughs> Raphael's Laboratory. Okay. Again, the music is just a playlist, so it's just randomly going to sync up when it syncs up, and other times it won't. Yeah. I mean, again, this must have been kind of mind-blowing in the 90s. Just because you could load this up in your Internet Explorer when you were on uh, your message boards and your e-bombs world and, you know, just checking them things out. AOL keyword websites. Can't tell if I'm supposed to have... Uh, it doesn't look like there's supposed to be any sound here. Jackal, if you're here, could, could you confirm if this has sound? Sound doesn't work on- oh, okay, thank you. Some of these do have sound. When I was testing them out, I heard some sound, but I don't know if it's... Whoa, something's about to fall? Or did we... Whoa, did he just piss himself? What the fuck?
Wow, I feel like I'm I'm in the plug and play all over again. I have to say though, I admire the attempt at a control stick. It's like early mobile game control sticks on the touchscreen. No, these don't contain audio, a, a good chunk of them. What do the buttons at the bottom do? Well, this one is, I think you fly. This one you walk. I don't know what this one is. Um, examine. Then these are just uh, camera controls. Hang, hang on. What, what, what? Let's load this one up again. So, all right. First of all, we have to like get a better viewpoint. What? What does it turn into? Just an eyeball. I was gonna say, that reminds me of some of the 3D head scans that I see in, like, VR chat. Just some person, and you click them, they turn into a skull. Like, really early version of that technology. Hornet. it. This one's, um, just a kaleidoscope. It's neat. Now, these are just, like, random little things. There's also worlds. Like, actual places to explore a little bit and it reminds me it actually kind of reminds me of worlds.com and early like internet um i guess what would you call them like early second life type things wow First life. A little weird that. A, a full viewpoint here. I guess for these you you just kinda You could just walk around and These weird little dudes have been walking around in this world for 25 years or more. Just waiting. Waiting to gain some sentience. And now that AI is good enough, they've returned. And here they are on my, on my screen. I like cards. This is like the first aesthetic. I'm just closing some windows. I could just do that like this. Actually, never mind. Um, Rail Club F. Spirit Tracks. Oh, this one gets rid of the controls at the bottom.
check the map though. A lot of this is like 95, the earliest. That's almost 30 years ago. At this point, which is just kind of fucking crazy to believe. Relief 1. This looks like the, the WarioWare minigame where she, she has the snot. This seems like just a 3D test. Uh, output? Oh, that doesn't work. The output button most certainly- Oh, cool! Well, you know, there is, there's a very easy shape one could make with such a tool. And that shape is a person's face. mouth and there's the chin and here's the nose and uh there you go face if I, can, if I can figure out how to actually paint the thing oh you don't it looks more like a vase than a face but yeah that's the thing that's like the optical illusion Rem remember M remember like the negative space All right, chat, I'm gonna show you something called floops. Now, before we check out the floops, I wanna actually show you, where is it? We've got information about the floops. Floops is a fully animated 3D VR ML, sorry, vermal cartoon character designed specifically to live on the web. Part worm, part frog, part mini human, with giant brown boots and shiny green mohawk. Floops appear, appears here in a new VRML episode every Tuesday and Thursday. So that's Floops. Look at me! I'm dying! Oops, sorry. Shelling down on potatoes, cranberry sauce, come on! Pass me a crumb! Anything! Hey, Floops! I have something special for you! Ooh. Ooh. Did I mention I prefer white meat? Amazing, amazing audio quality on that as well. But yeah, this was like, you know how like YouTube animation is like the, you know, the thing now? Well, this was the original form of that. This was the original Grey Leno. I feel pretty, oh so pretty, I feel pretty and witty and g Hey! Hey, what is this, a zoo or something? How about a little privacy here? I'm serious, go click on something else, this is my day off. <laughs> Jeez, tourists. I bet for 90s kids they were like, Whoa, he broke the fourth, he's talking to me! Well, we had a deal. The pet has to go. Okay, Dad. How could they do this to me? Let's take him to the bathroom. Oh, please! Have mercy! Someone said this hey, freak would be a good guest on Grey Leno. I'm alive! Bon voyage, Flipper! <laughs> hey, don't forget to put the seat down when you're done! <laughs> wow. Yeah. <laughs> Um, if, yeah, I don't know if anyone's made this freak in VR chat, but... Hello, world! Free at last! See you later, kid! I'm out of here! Burr. It's cold! God, that's a long way down! <clears throat> you know, I'd hate to spoil the kid's little show-and-tell party. 
I guess my great escape can uh, wait a while. Well, I am so having so much fun. <laughs> I finally escaped! I'm free! I'm also hungry. I wonder what there is to eat around here. Aha! Fast food! But not fast enough. Oh my I god. Someone just said he he's funnier than you, Vinny. No. I mean, now do you feel that way after that one? Come on. Come on. I made Grey Leno. Grey Leno. Another another person said he's he's um he's so pathetic. I love him. He's all right. I like him too. He's growing on me. Wow, he's actually better at piano than I am, too. Sorry, the sound cuts out when I click outside the window. Wow, the great outdoors! I never thought I'd live to see it! I wonder, is it really safe out here at night? Yes. Very. Perfectly safe. Ooh, check, please. Ah. Floops is the, <laughs> is the third vine sauce. <laughs> yeah. So, you think you're pretty smart, huh? Giving me the old gaslight routine. Well, it's not gonna work. Sooner or later, you're gonna quack. Come on, duck boy, give it up! Very well. Your suspicions are correct. I do talk. But I am not a toy duck. I have come from a distant world to observe your planet. Wow, nice plot twist. I really didn't see that coming, did you? I, I hope the duck comes back in a future episode. So, you're a rubber duck from oh, another did, planet. Did. Isn't that cute? Well, tell me, oh superior being, what's the meaning of life? Breadcrumbs. God, breadcrumbs? Oh, what a fake. Look, if you're an alien, I'm the Easter Bunny. So, would you like chocolate eggs or marshmallow chickies? Ah, oh, floops. I have been summoned. It is time to report to the Mother Duck. No, don't go! There's so much you could teach. I should like, 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 how do you do that cool death ray thing? Another time. Maybe. Remember, the truth is out there. Oh, that was so cheap. That was my favorite arc of the Floops, Floops saga, the uh, alien duck arc. I still can't figure out those fish from last episode. Where did they come from? Whew, crazy. Whoa, not again. Anybody home? Fish. Oh no. That's what I was afraid of. This place is turning interactive. I still oh, I thought can't I could figure out on... those fish from I thought I could click on the fish, I can't. Okay, no no, we're we're gonna keep flooping, don't worry, we got some more Oh not again. Oh geez. No, we got a couple more floops. So, it turns out that my life well, has quality? become interactive. <laughs> Ridiculous. Watch this. Touch the dish, get a fish. Wow, magical. Oh, I suppose you want to try it. Go ahead, click on the dish. I wonder if I could make this work with mealworms. I wonder if I could make this... I broke it. I wonder if I could... 
it didn't take long to break it. Hmm. Do you smell something fishy around here? Uh oh, this looks bad. Oh, the Don't fish are any fast moves or I'm lunch meat. Whatever you do, don't click the fish. I had to say, don't click the fish. And that was it. That's all the floops that was ever made. Okay, now there's a couple more. We got a couple more. Hey, I just figured out that I can come and go as I please. <laughs> Watch this. Taxi! Ta taxi? Someone's going to cut that line on something. just to end after that one word, you know. You called that a taxi? All right. It'll happen. Take me to the beach. Take ya! Hey, I just figured out. Someone said it reminds him of Joe Cartoon. Taxi! I remember Joe Cartoon, and that it does kind of remind me of that, yeah. My favorite thing about being in a cartoon is the absence of reality. In fact, if I lie down and close my eyes for a second, I just might wake up in a whole new... ...situation? Weird. Yikes! Okay, close, open. Uh-oh. This could get ugly. Alright. My favorite thing oh, about being in no, a cartoon floops, is... no, we, we needed to see... No. Oh. ...in a second, I just might wake up in a whole new... I don't, I don't think you can... That's it, I think it was just the, that one thing that you could do. What what happens if you click on something? I'm clicking. What what happens if you click on floops, something? Floops, I clicked. All right. What what happens if you click on? Hey! This oh, it was is a two-parter. Oh my God! Get me out of this! You have to wait like a whole oh, week please. to find out what happened to Floops. Click on the train a lot. God! Would it kill you to try a little harder next time? <laughs> Sorry, man. How you doing? I'm Fluke, not Fluke. He uh, had to go away. They say it was because of creative differences, but just between you, me, and the problem, mealworms couldn't get enough. <laughs> now I've got the job. Tragic, isn't it? Oh well, that's showbiz. Wait, was that a different voice? Hang on, let me let me click that again because the the audio cut out. I I sorry. Hey, ha bad you habit. Doing? I'm fluke, not fluke. He uh, had to go away. They say it was because of creative differences, but just between you, me, and the palm tree, get a little problem. Mealworms couldn't get enough. <laughs> oh. I got the job. Tragic, isn't it? Oh well. And that was it. Like the, the that's probably when Floops jumped the shark. There's more, there's like some incomplete floopses that don't have sound. I don't know if they were preserved properly, but there's, there's some, you know, unfortunately we don't have any audio for these floopses, but, um, yeah, I think after they changed floops, just, oh, it fell off. As soon as the, the voice actor left and they got a new one and they got this fluke guy or whatever, that was it. It was never the same. Also, apparently Dilbert had a Think, short. Therefore, I am. But I'm micromanaged. Therefore, I am not. <coughs> I have a philosophical question for you. You're not me. Therefore, you're irrelevant. Well, that's that's hilarious. Then there's just stuff like this, just random animations. I don't think that had like an ongoing series. Yeah. 
a little South Parky in some ways, but also I think elf murder was a big topic in the late nineties. I don't know if anyone else noticed this trend, but late nineties, early two thousands, one of the funniest things you could do was actually murder elves. That seems to have been a thing, like a genre unto itself. Man, this is good, but it's no floops. And yeah, sorry, no, no sound either. But I mean, like I said, the cool thing is this was in your browser. So you could just like click the things and get your 3D and you can even like look around the scene too. So I'm pretty sure even the floop scenes you could probably, you know what, let's find out. Hello, world. Free at last. See you later, kid. I'm out of here. Mm, no. <sighs> Doesn't look like it. It's cold. God, that's a long... No, unfortunately, not for floops. Um, what is bliss.com? I guess my great escape can uh, wait a while. Blitcom? Well, wow, that sounds a lot like Bitcoin. You don't know me yet, but you will. Bliss here. Bliss.com. 100% pure vermal cyber girl. Vermal. Smart and well-traveled. Now, I am so excited. So Because I just 90s. got the coolest gig. I am going to be the Blitcom celebrity spokesbean. The real first the VTuber. The web poster girl. Check out my motto. The face in cyberspace. Nespa. Huh. Now why did they hire me for this job? Well, because I move fast. These days I'm everywhere. I'm Oh god, ubiquitous. I need to lower it. Chad, I'm gonna lower it. I'm sorry. I need to lower it. Okay. Weigh myself, I was only 230. And boy, do I load quick. Now, I gotta try out some new material on you. So you ready for this? Here goes. Today I am brought to you by the wonderful guys at SGR. Uh, cut! Let's try another take. Okay, how about this? If your browser's moving slow, try the latest at Cosmo. Wow. Software, that is. <laughs> that felt good. Okay, one more. Bear with me. Listen, it Bliss and you Lara and Croft was really popular too. at the time. Yeah. Oh, you know, I think I'm gonna like this. Um, there's more of this too. Hang on. What? I think there's n not the complete story, but there's other episodes oh, here. Hi. Is so the Mars Rover? Back. I want to show you my really cool find. But first, you're going to have to understand that I am obsessed with aliens. I mean, if there's life in here and there's no life floops. out there, there has got to be life out there. I mean, it can't all be lies. I watch the X Files. I know. It's so another X Files reference. My latest toy. Check it out. I got it off the JPL site. It was a cinch. I think it's some kind of high-tech skateboard. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it yet, but I think it's got a lot of potential. Cute, huh? It's a, it's a little um, hard to control, but, but don't worry. I'm fine. Just got to work the technical stuff out. Okay. I finally got this thing working right. Now, One week what later. What am I gonna do with it? What kind of wonderful havoc am I gonna wreak? Yo, Bliss, got some news for you. Coming through. Pushy technology. I am so over it. Someone said in chat, imagine that body naked. Please, chat member, 
Maybe I should. You need to stop. You need to stop. On second thought, maybe not. Here, let's. Uh, I finally got this thing working. Let's get right. in real close and now, check those legs what out. Am I gonna wow. Do Oh, man. What kind of wonderful havoc am I gonna wreck? Yo, that's, that's the good stuff right there. Star Fox polygons, if I've ever seen them. technology. I am so over... Oh, is there anybody that is, there? Yes, peak form. <laughs> exactly. Hey, you came back. You look a little down. Can I get you something to eat? Oh, wait, I forgot. My cash is empty. How about some Java? It always perks me right up. What? No, I gotta tell you, my social life could really use a little acceleration. You go out, you find a nice place to chat, and who do you meet? Ha! Huh. Let's just say I wouldn't take them home to meet my mother. For all I know, they could be my mother. Do I have a mother? Anyway, last night I was on this one webcast, and I was cornered the whole night by this pushy tech guy trying to sell me virtual real estate. Oh, no shit. You pay. No shit. Just waiting for everybody I else just to bought show more up. land in the metaverse. You know, I gotta say though, on the bright side, I do have you. H hang on, chat. I need to do. We're gonna do a thing. I hope you don't mind. It it'll be worth it. Okay. Hang on. I, I just bought Oh, is there anybody out there? Hey, you came back. You look a little down. Can I get you something to eat? Oh, wait, I forgot. They were trying to warn us all these years ago. How about ago. some Java? It always perks me right up. You know, I gotta tell you, my social life could really use... Chroma key out the... Go out. The windows. Nice oh, that's a good idea. It. Who do you meet? That's a good idea. Hang on, let me do that. I, this is going to be even better, chat. Hang on. Chroma key? Um, or, or, or color key. Hang on. Color picker? Right? We'll do that. And then, uh, let me see if I can get the threshold a little bit more. It's going to... Uh oh, her eyes are going to be kind of kind of weird, but don't worry about it. Here, watch. I have, I have a great idea, chat. It's going to be awesome. This, yeah, this, yeah, yeah. Trust me on this one. Okay. Hmm. What I'm wondering is why is it not showing? I chroma keyed out the windows. Hang on. Hang on. Uh, it didn't. That's weird. What happened here? I thought the bit was going to be so good. Okay, anti-aliasing. It's in the corner. Let me play it for a second. Maybe that'll... Oh, oh, okay, 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 hang on, hang on. <laughs> I want to get it just right. <laughs> no, no, it's gonna be a good bit. I swear. I gotta edit live though. Otherwise, it's not. Yeah, see, that's the problem. Is that he's in the way, so it's gonna spoil the surprise for future generations. Chat. Oh, is there anybody out there? Hey, you came back. You look a little down. Can I get you something to eat? Oh wait, I forgot. My cash is empty. How about some Java? It always perks me right up! You know, I gotta tell you, my social life could really use a little acceleration. You go out, you find a nice place to chat, and who do you meet? Ha! Huh. Let's just say I wouldn't take them home to meet my mother. For Why all not? I know, they could be my mother. Do I have a mother? Anyway. 
Last night I was on this one webcast and I was cornered the whole night by this pushy tech guy trying to sell me virtual real estate. I, I, I just spot my land in the meadows. Now I'm getting paid cash with Alistair. We have virtual land all across the globe. Across the globe. Next wave is digital, catch me on the way up. It's so go. worth it. Book up a couple more. Watch mine gonna go up as I'm about to go nuts. It's about to go nuts. Now I'm getting paid red and cash with Alice Earth. Alice Earth. Alice, Alice Earth. Oh, it's so worth it. Man, I'm so pleased with myself right now. Ah. <sighs> Oh, that's a test. This one's not working. And here's the loft. Oh, yeah, that was definitely worth it. A scary spider. That's a thorax, not a dumpy. So. You're so right. Okay. So then we have just objects. So this is an alien. Clearly. I mean, it says alien. I mean. Mine looks a bit like an egg being anyway this one is it's called cloud butterfly we might need some more music for this Not really, I don't know, it's weird. Uh, Electro Cat. Electro Cat actually really fits the music. I don't know what the fuck this is. Oh, god damn it. Fucking Microsoft Edge. Get out of here. It doesn't work in Edge. It only works in old Internet Explorer chat. We just got Edge jump scared. It, again! Dude. Alright, we just get past that one. Hey, you know what that background looks a lot like? I, 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 I gotta stop. I really need to stop that. there's any interaction here but it is a floating head whoa this is called house clearly there might be some different viewpoints no not for this one Kind of reminds me of Secret of Mana music. You hear that? It's got like a similar chord change. It's, it's pretty good. I'm into it. 
This is also, again, this is from Mario Artist Paint Studio. Track number one, Jellyfish. That's the name of this one, if you're wondering. I just remember Mario Artist having good music, and I figured it would um, suit a th thing like this. Cool stuff there. This is just called Lobster. This one is 015XX. Whomst is this man? Office complex. Stonehenge. Interesting stuff. American Gothic. So now we're now we're in the worlds segment of this. And again, it has it like different views, different viewpoints, view from above, um, the exit. Okay, when you okay. So some of these things would take you to different worlds. Unfortunately, that doesn't seem to work, so I have to keep loading them manually. So sometimes it would take you to a web page, sometimes it would take you to a different world. This one's called Bridge. This one's called Cathedral. It's called Coffee. Ah, uh, yes, Gordon Freeman. Oh, fuck off. Again, these links don't even work, so whenever I see that anchor, I should probably just not click it. I just clicked it. But yeah, you can see the fantasy links. The old man. Giza. I'm a Giza strip. Remember that? I had a, some of you probably remember that. I had a dream. And I wrote down the dream and then I woke up and I saw that I, I wrote out I'm a Giza strip. I don't know, don't worry about it. Uh, house? Window? Bell? Blackboard? Apple? There's just... a student forever raising his hand. With There's no teacher. There's no one here. He's the only student waiting for someone to acknowledge his existence. And that's us now. Oh man, not- not after that. Now that music- that previous music was so, like, perfect for this. Pagan Sound is the name of this one. Again, perfect music for this. Oh, hell yeah. 
This is good. This one doesn't work. This one doesn't work either. Uh-oh. Yeah, some of them just aren't working. Dolphin noises? Oh, okay, I see. You can actually change the speed of your walking. Again, this is like internet archaeology. This some of this stuff might not have been seen for many, many years until Jackal put it together for this pack. I don't know, maybe there's enthusiasts who are looking at vermal stuff. Maybe some of you even remember this. But also, why is the frog here from the Gigglebone gang? Uh, Bungie? music. Are you enjoying the geometry? I'm just fascinated by all this. That is fucking Blade Runner synth. It's the Yamaha something something something. Vinny, we need this playlist. Just type Mario Artist Paint Studio The Ocean Floor Track 1. Mario Artist Music. Oh, the, the actual Taj Mahal. Vinny, what if I use Bing to find it? Well, it may not turn out right. Remember, somebody spent probably quite a time, a bit of time on these before we had apps that could render shapes easily. Yeah, that's that's true. This probably took a fuckload of computing power, and now we just take it for granted. Was the reflection the 2D render? No, I think that's 3D, but reversed. Library V- oh, Jackal, this library one is huge. There, there's, like, too much stuff in here. I don't know which ones to do. Um, just like, comfy chair? Uh... First floor? Skip it. Okay. Forgot to write which ones. Then there's a tour. Whoa. Yeah, this- this one is, like, super detailed. There are so many viewpoints. 
And there's actually like textures once in a while. That's pretty impressive. Song Planet? I don't know how to load this one. It doesn't appear that there is a... Oh wait, Planet 4. Here we go. Let's see if this works. Whoa, that's so cool! In the beginning. What the fuck? It's, it's all drum and bass music. It's so late 90s, it hurts. You, is your neck gonna be okay, dude? Yeah, you just go around to different places and you get music. So you could just like craft work. Oh no shit, craft work. Oh, it's the robots. I know that one. Soundgarden, Rusty Rusty Cage, what? Gonna break my rusty cage. Death metal. Wow, we get a lot of different genres here. New metal. Fugazi. Oh boy. I remember this video. This scared me. Turns out he's a scary guy. Eurotechno. <laughs> I don't know that song, but it sounds familiar. I'm just a teenage dirtbag, baby. This is like DMCA surfing the game. It's like, how long can I listen to one of these songs without it getting claimed? Hives? Oh my god. Yeah, th this is like... I find this to be very interesting. It's like a, a snapshot into the popular genres of the time. I can't get up there, but... Amazing. And what, what's this one? Oh, this one doesn't work. All right, damn. The virtual heart? I uh, don't know how to start this one, but there's just some really weird names here, like, like Pig Zero. Like, are we going back to the fucking mitochondria? Virtual museum. I wonder if this is like museum of anything goes. Why do you still have that? I don't know. Yeah, I'm looking for the um, the file. Jackal's going to try to get the name of the, the map that I have to click. Because there's like a ton of them. Try heart final. 
Let's see, heart final. Oh. Oh, that's what this is. Okay, this is an appropriate music for this. But, you know, if you want to learn... Interesting. Oh yeah, th this one's just called Vermal. Dot Vermal. There is a museum. Oh, okay, there is an actual museum for that one as well. Uh, the virtual heart dot org. Well, that one's, that's why it was that. The virtual heart dot org. Vinny, any more hot babes in this pack? <laughs> you serious, dude? Hell yeah. I don't know, maybe. We'll find out. Um, there might be some more Lara Croft alikes. We'll see. Okay, hang on. We can go to that museum real quick, and then we'll move on to the Flux stuff. I don't know why my voice cracked there. Just a little... Main dot world. Okay, so this one's the guided tour. Someone said I'm way, way too high for this fucking shit. Then just close your eyes and enjoy the music. This is Doshin the Giant music called Sunset. I've never heard it before and I, I kind of think I love it. This is cool as fuck. I really enjoy stuff like this. Um, we're gonna take a look at some of the ones in the other folder. Okay, so this, I have to use something called Flux Player. So I'm gonna do that real quick. Flux Player. And it just closed itself. All right, it's open. Let's see how this looks. If I can even capture it properly, I might be able to. I think we got something. 
Okay. I'm going to load some files. I'm going to load the arcade. Sadly, this song gets claimed by some dude who sampled the entire song and just slowed it down on YouTube. That's nice. Man, I love the way copyright works. It's so good. So the frame rates here are not as good. Um, is there anything I can do to fix that? Get a 4090. Oh. <laughs> it wasn't like this before. Hang on one second. Let me let me remove that and see. Oh, you know what it is? It's it's I got it. It was game capture that was doing that. I can fix this. Just need to do a little bit of work here. that'll do. So you got an arcade here. Complete with a couple games. I think. Uh, sadly, this doesn't seem to do anything. Some of these viewpoints might be broken, too. Looks cool, though. I mean, you can click the arcade machines, but they don't... It's only broken... Because normally this would have been part of the whole city. I see. Oh, wrong button. Damn. Hang on. So we got Arcade and Arcade 1. Okay, Arcade 1 is... Just not any, not a thing. It's just not a thing. So... Places... We got the Arena. explore or I can just click on different viewpoints so yeah this would have been like worlds.com now Jackal would there have been other people this was like a little virtual MMO on a website <clears throat> huh I have a link to it on the way back and a text file in the folder so there would have been people here was like second life earlier but so what happens if I go to that website like will it actually um welcome it's it's just cool to look around okay like there won't be people like no one can join anymore right but here's the bank no, no one can join. I'll, I'll take a look at it. We'll explore like this. 
this is not the appropriate music for this. Um, I want to do some more Mario artist. That was F Zero music for their uh, for the sixty four DD. So good for this. didn't work. Okay, these aren't loading now for some reason. Alright, we'll try again. again. I think I have to reload it again, too. Love all the weird virtual advertisements. I mean, it, it, that's exactly what it is in VR chat as well, but just all the old crusty models. Unfortunately, this thing just keeps kind of glitching, so I'm just going to keep trying to reload it. Local CTNG. This one doesn't work. Okay. House 
doesn't work. I think this is where the problem lies. Are these? Let's see if this works. Hmm. All right, so I'm trying to load up some different ones. We got, well, I think there's just a couple that glitched it a bit. Yeah, so you can see like the progression, like you go through the elevator, then you can get to the bank, you can get to the lobby. The spaceport. the city hall. Someone just said Lakitu is killing it with the camera. Someone said, how the fuck is this music hidden away in an obscure Mario Paint game? Honestly, the Mario Artist Paint Studio music is some of my favorite music I've heard. Like, for any creative video game ever. Please play this. It's my favorite Mario Paint song. Well, it's just creative extra. Oh, it's. I see what you, you posted the troll. Please remain seated as the shuttle proceeds to land. Thank you. Thank you. Ship. I saw a little fella on oh, no, those reliefs. Does kind of look like Torak a little bit. This is the jail. So if you <laughs> somehow broke the rules of of this um, Vermal MMO, you go to jail. I also thought for a second that was that was a little. He's a little warfy. It's like a warf alike. Sci fi sub zero. For some reason, we're still getting the sounds of the. Uh... Oh god. Oh god. It, it happened again. Alright. Just uh, load up that again. This will happen every now and then, everybody. This only has the one viewpoint. This one may have its own music. There's apparently an effort to revive this. It's called, like, Cybertown Revival or something, says a chat member. 
That would be neat. Even just for me to, like, hop in and explore, like, worlds. Trying its best, chat. I'm just gonna go back to the, uh... The ocean floor tracks. Because it just fits these so well. Just one more each time. Or, yeah, once more per song. Sci-fi colony. Theater. I wonder if what you would watch here. Like, just someone performing? I, I mean, I, I've seen it in... Second Life and VR chat and stuff like that, but yeah, it's probably just someone playing music, talking, do, making joke. I make joke. I wonder, you know, when you do these things, like I've done a lot of this internet archaeology stuff, digital space traveler worlds, um, and other such things, and, uh, kind of think active worlds as well. It's all very interesting to see the 3D models and everything, but if you think about the actual MMO aspect of the game, there were people that, like, met, became friends, fell in love, got married, got divorced. You know, sometimes when I was in those worlds, there was, like, tributes to people that, you know, died. Not to be overly uh, morbid about it, but that's what's crazy about this, and as much as I, you know, don't spend a, I don't like MMOs. I do like VR chat once in a while uh, with friends, and um, in my later days, I don't really socialize online as much as I used to, but I always found that stuff appealing and alluring, and thinking about it yeah, this stuff was like 25 years ago. And we're just kind of flying through what is memories for people. Like, who knows who met at the water park? Like, this is someone's years of their life and friends and relationships and maybe some of their best times. So yeah, um, as much as it is like, look at the old models, they're funny. It's that mostly. I t but once in a while, I like to just think about that. That's where my mind wanders to if I end up exploring these worlds long enough. So someone in chat wrote, someone sexual role played right there on that green and then like a crying frog. That's one way to break the tension. <laughs>
So... Let's see. So that's places. Um, Jackal, I, we're running out of time a little bit here. Anything else you would recommend? Flux Worlds. Um, anything else you'd recommend I check out? For the next ten minutes or so? All the stuff in Cybertown, I guess, is pretty much just, um... Like, that's all the files for all this stuff. We can check out the webpage. Let's see what that's like. Um, looking for that file. Reflux Worlds. Okay, uh... Check out the websites. Websites, here we go. Vinny, in 20 years, people are going to explore Fortnite maps like this. Yeah. So it's funny because Internet Explorer, which I would like to use, which no one ever said, um, just immediately closes and opens Edge instead. So you kind of have to force a workaround. Let's see. This website works better in Microsoft Edge. All right, then. So be it. We'll check out the websites. Welcome to Cyber City. CNET, best of the web. complex. Let's see if any of this stuff actually loads. Body part analyzer? It's been unstable lately. Theater of the Absurd. Welcome to Spatula City. Wait, I, Jackal, I thought this was like you could explore this place in 3D, or is this just like a bunch of links? Just curious. 3D VR. Oh, it's just the website. Okay, that's good. That looks like, what's his name? Vision. Okay, this, I think, is, uh, download. Shades of Evil. Here is the map! It's immediately what I think of. The mud connector. It's a multi-user dungeon, or mud for short. It's the Space Jam website all over again, yeah. Things to do in Cybertown. Sports zone. Spirituality center. Guess you could buy some land if you want. 
multimedia visual chat rooms with avatars. So yeah, it's just it links you to the things you can make your own characters, all that stuff. I would recommend looking at the Digitalo one or did you meant digital? Where, where's that now? Oh, oh, uh, hang on. The MUDs were insane. They were basically text-based MMOs where you wandered around and role-played with other people in various locations. Okay, hang on. I'm, I'm looking for the, uh... Oh, okay, here it is. See? Sorry about that. The epicenter for cyberpunk digital culture. I feel like I'm playing Hypnospace Outlaw. How tipping in cyberspace can it be done? That's so fucking mm. 90s. Just downloading stuff. Welcome to Digitalo. Yep, that sounds about right. Shiba Newsstand and Vix Reviews. <laughs> Review Video Blaster Capture Card. Do you ever wish you could take a clip from your favorite movie or TV show, find yourself saying hello to new online friends? Drop it in their mailbox, assemble a multimedia video collection of your last trip to Central America, or just snapping off a couple frames, yeah, we're snapping, all right, of your favorite objects, making them JPEGs. The Video Blaster Capture Board lets you do these things, and easily, too. Wow. Click here for a 400K sample. No, that one's not there. Stun Gun of the Month. Daily weather satellite images. What year is it? 1999. 4 p.m. Eastern on the 8th of February, 1999. Cloning sheep. Is this going to be about Dolly? Yep, it is. We lamb named Dolly. Welcome to Digitalo. The Gibson Matrix? <laughs> oh my god. It's like... Almost Matrix music, but not quite. to connect my electrodes hang on a second no shit what is this nonsense turn on your new cyber deck oh this is fake william gibson is one of the founders of the cyberpunk genre oh okay neuromancer stuff okay didn't he do the alien 3 script that got rejected or am i thinking of a different person he did, okay. Okay, well anyway, our our diodes are connected, so let's uh let's jack in. All right. Some of it works, not all of it. Uh, I thought it said Keanu. Welcome to Digitalo. That is just astounding. That is just astounding. Uh, 
Okay, yeah, I know. I tried to download something and it, the link doesn't work anymore. This is just what websites were like. I mean, you know what? Even though this does seem kind of sloppy, and, and it is optical fornication, like, you know, we joke about the Space Jam website. I will say that there's a part of me that misses when the web wasn't just four websites and the same, like, horrendously, um, I wouldn't say boring necessarily, but just drab, just drab stuff over and over again. It makes it easy and quick and you know what you're getting and you don't have to, like, navigate through hidden web pages and, you know, like, flaming skulls, <laughs> but there's something charming about this stuff. And someone said there's no adventure. It isn't covered in ads. Yeah, it's true. Well, I mean, even when I started streaming, the, the idea of making money from streaming was just like as far from my mind as possible. I like there was no there was no real way to do that. Not this one. Uh, it took years for that to even become a thing. I remember being fa uh, like fascinated by Google AdSense. I was like, what is this? You can make money on the internet? Wow, I made $10? Welcome. And now Crypto Luigi wants us to buy land on the meadow. Never, never. This is initial voice logic reconstruction test number one. How about this? Wow. Diagnostics on voice recognition. Hot babes discovered, chat member. Completed. At this level, all functions appear normal. The hacker manifesto. Damn kids, they're all alike. I am a hacker. Enter my world. <laughs> wow. The movie list. Blade Runner. Screamers. Total Recall. Excellent acting. Just kidding. Johnny Mnemonic. Hardware. The Terminator. More excellent acting. <laughs> Give him a break. He's trying. Um, the Strange Days, Alien, Aliens, Alien 3. Really? Yeah. Uh, you know what? Alien 3 is not too bad. The William Gibson one would have been better. Lawnmower Man. Uh, Tetsuo, Tetsuo 2, Max Headroom, of course. I guess this was before The Matrix, because Matrix would be, like, number one up here. Here are some Blade Runner links. We did it, everybody. We found Blade Runner. We did it. Not found. <laughs> Never mind. We didn't find it. Site had 1996 on the homepage. Uh, it says this is a oh you know what this is a screenshot this page January thirteenth nineteen ninety eight that's what it says up top here let me see if this gets updated we can go to May let me let me go to nineteen ninety nine and see if the matrix is is added no unfortunately not. Donkey Kong. Here's some book recommendations. Music. Todd Rundgren, Brian Eno, Guar? I didn't realize Guar was cyberpunk. I guess so. I didn't realize Motorhead was gothic. But yeah, Chemical Brothers, Mo Moby. Alright. 
Yeah, this this is something else. Um, really, really fascinated by by this. And there, there were awful. Welcome Please don't do that. Links to our uh, our favorite webcams. Metaverse cam. We, we, we that that term dates back to 1998. Everybody, we just found. Turtle cam. I don't think any of these links are going to be working. Okay, I don't know if it's even possible to find out. This is a bit of a stretch. Wait, live from New York City. That doesn't make any sense. Back to the verse. Um, feet can't. What? Um, hang on. Okay, it's. I just wanted to check. Oh, okay. Now with over three hundred fifty thousand visitors. I like how the music accidentally ended up being perfect for that. Turtle cam? That turtle could still be alive. That, I, that's exactly the inflection I wanted, by the way, on the word turtle. That was, um... That was what I, exactly how I in, intended, intended that. <clears throat> Anyway, this turtle cam doesn't work, unfortunately. But yeah, I would like to know if anyone could find out somehow through magic or wizardry, leave a comment when this becomes a video, maybe, uh, on what the metaverse cam actually was. It said New York City, but why'd they call it the metaverse? The word metaverse was used in sci-fi in at least 1992. Oh, okay, I didn't know that, actually. Welcome to Cliff's Dunkin' Donuts, located in Garfield, New Jersey. So, this is from 1999, and it is a picture of a Dunkin' Donuts. Just some people working at a Dunkin'. Mental. Wallet camera? I do remember stuff like this being interesting though, like... Yeah, people would just like point cameras at random things and you would get an update like once a, <laughs> once every couple minutes really wish turtle cam worked that that's upsetting some italian dude's office cam hang on well here's sydney australia and let's see the italian dude's office not found oh well welcome to digitalo Jolt. Oh my god, alright. Welcome to Digitalo. So we learned a lot here, chat. Um, this went by quick. This was like super fast. I I didn't expect this segment to go uh, as long as it did, and honestly, as quickly as it did. It's um 1.42 a.m. So it's time for me to get going. But, uh, yeah, I know this isn't the haha -ha wackies <laughs> all the time kind of thing, but, uh, it's, it's nice to do stuff like this once in a while. And, um, 
I hope you enjoyed it. Good pack, Jackal. Really interesting stuff. And I'm sure we'll be doing some more commercials at some point soon. And all the, the rest of that stuff. I also have that uh, D-Make pack that I'll get to at some point. And of course, we will... We will do um, that road kill game, which I think you'll find the cutscenes to be very entertaining. But yeah, we took a, a look at the past and we saw some weird stuff. And I think it was worth it. And this music just got really weirdly dramatic for this. But thank you for watching, everybody. Thank you. I appreciate it. And I appreciate the continued support and everything that you do for me. And it's just incredibly kind of you. And I'm just so grateful that you're all here watching this stuff. So I'll keep doing it. God damn it. Oh, and Resident Evil 4 Mercenaries. Donkey Kong Jungle Beat this week. And maybe a couple surprises as well. I'm not really sure. Well, I know what some of it will be. But... See you soon. Bye, everyone. Easter eggs for people oh, who yeah. grew up playing uh, Nintendo games. Were you excited to play Bowser? Uh, yeah, I was totally excited. Because